This is the main, the main atrium. And as you can see, like this industrial vacuum cleaner and things. So we're still cleaning up a bit here. Um, the planetarium's right here. This is the Sac State Planetarium, brand new. Haven't even had our grand opening yet. We just had a campus group um, catching a show in here. So we're trying to educate some of the people on campus as much as we can, get some good word of mouth going. Uh, it is a 40 foot wide dome. There are 120 seats in here. The dome is illuminated by two ultra high def 4K projectors. One in the front that illuminates the back of the dome and one in the back that illuminates the front of the dome. Together, they create a seamless 360 degree image for a completely immersive experience. So when this building was built, we added on a couple of large lecture rooms and these are open to the whole campus. So these rooms are designed to have students learn by doing as opposed to sitting and listening to someone talk. A few years ago, there was a project that had to happen, I think it was um, on campus, and in order to get that work done, they had to cut down some trees on campus. And you know this is a Tree USA campus. So they kept all of the wood, and that wood has been repurposed now into this building. What we have here, these are two stands for our two large telescopes. And right above you is a retractable roof. So when we want to use the telescopes at night, we can, that roof will just move back this way and they'll have a view of the night sky. This is also part of the observatory. So it's also a fabulous view. Um, so this is the observatory terrace and you can see all of these platforms here. These are for our smaller telescopes. So we can take these out, put them out and then store them away at other times. These are research labs. And so this building actually has dedicated research labs um, for our faculty and then our faculty work with students. So really for our students. And what we did was we took faculty who are in similar areas and we did, instead of giving you one little lab and you one little lab, we did these large open labs where they share the space. So let's go and look in one of the labs and take, see how it works. So this is one of the biology labs um, for genetics. Find the students are facing each other, not just facing the front of the room. This is a lab, it's for hands-on experience. A week from now, it's, these boxes will be gone and we'll be, these classes will be set up for class and students will be in here.